Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel Mastering Option Studio. Here is a quick disclaimer. Um, this is this video is purely for a educational and learning purpose only. Any profit and loss of yours, neither me or my channel would be responsible for it. So please take informed decisions and consult your financial advisor before taking any of the trades. Okay, what a fantastic view, uh, fantastic fall we had today, right? So as mentioned in yesterday's video, I'll quickly play it for you. Uh, we had a bear issue both from data as well as stats, right? Let's have a quick look at so it. So this is again kind of mixed. So now what is the tiebreaker in such a situation, right? So in such a situation from pros perspective, there are 2,39,000 call shots, but only 84,000 put shots. So clearly the call shots are higher and that's why I take the view of a, uh, I take a bear issue basically. Okay. Coming back to the charts, uh, we see a nice consolidation. So it has to break out on either side. So any 15 minute candle below 21,680, right? It will lead to a quick target of 21,580, right? And so it was very clear that uh, morning it opened somewhere flat, but the moment it broke 21,680, right? We had a fantastic fall of 100 points very quickly and it fell below 21,580 till 21,555 as well. It was a really good move uh, as expected in line with both data and charts. And on Bank Nifty as well, uh, as I mentioned in yesterday's video, you can watch out in the video, uh, we expected 47, uh, 785 as first target and then we expected 47,700 as well. Both the targets were achieved today. So it was a perfect, a perfect, uh, trade expectation and, and, and it's a perfect trade, right? So what is the analysis for tomorrow? So I'll quickly go through the data. Index futures, as you can see, this is a major and significant change where in 17,000 longs are added in net by retailers. So from big player perspective, we take the opposite of retailers, which is bearish. I mean, from uh, FIS, it's neutral. Uh, pro, it's again neutral or flat. Here is the interesting part on index calls. Retailers have added huge 2.8 or 2.9 lakh call shots, call longs, right? So from big player's perspective, it's a bearish sign. The FIs have slightly reduced their call longs and those have fantastically added uh, huge call shots. So together, index call segment indicates bearishness clearly. From index put segment, again, despite the fall, um, retailers have further added close to 1 lakh put shots and FIs have added some put longs and uh, pros have reduced their put shots to very minimal, that is 30,000 quantity, right? So clearly from index puts as well, it's a bearish sign. So from beta, there is no doubt, but clearly it's bearish. Sign. Now moving on to the charts, uh, we can see this D2 will be the supports for bank nifty, but for nifty, uh, we can expect uh, time to gap down and further 21,600. After that, it will be directly 21,500 to 460. This area could get filled partially or fully tomorrow and act as a support for the intraday, right? So it's clearly bearish from both charts and data. Only thing is it should preferably open a gap down to have a bearish, strong bearish scenario and preferably break, break 21,600 for a quick downfall. So I hope this video is helpful. Um, I have observed that close to 50 or 60% 60 of viewers are not subscribed to this channel. So if you're finding the content helpful, please do like, share and subscribe. Thank you all. Have a good day.